Thank you very much. Yes, my priorities uh, are to uh, bring Georgia uh, in Europe. Uh, I came from Europe to Georgia for that. I'm now the uh, president-elect. Uh, I've been elected by a society that wants more Europe into Georgia and Georgia into the European Union. And that will be these six years uh, will be very important for that. Uh, of course, a new president has less directly political and executive powers, but being directly elected by the population, the president uh, will have uh, lots of influence uh, and its representation uh, power outside of the country uh, is inscribed in the constitution. Uh, and as a former uh, European French diplomat of 30 years and more, uh, with my experience of uh, and contacts in international organizations and in European Union, I think I'm very well suited to accompany this uh, last transition uh, of Georgia towards the European Union, NATO and its uh, Western destiny. Well, given uh, this week's events, are you worried about aggression from uh, Vladimir Putin on your border? Well, uh, aggression from Vladimir Putin on our borders has not, never stopped. Uh, we have an occupying line uh, within Georgian territory uh, that is moving every day. Uh, we have people that are living close to this occupying line that are abducted const constantly. Uh, it's a permanent threat. Uh, and of course, we are concerned uh, about also the security uh, in the Black Sea, which is our other border. And what is happening today in uh, Ukraine is another reason uh, for concern for Georgia. So uh, ever more than ever, we are uh, dependent and uh, awaiting the reaction of our uh, European and American and NATO partners. Uh, our security uh, depends very directly uh, on them. Uh, on our occupying line, it's the European Union monitoring mission uh, that is here to monitor that line. Uh, and we probably need uh, a more direct um, involvement uh, of the European Union to preserve better uh, the security around this occupying line without making it become uh, anything closer to a border because our border and our uh, integrity uh, is what Georgia and its European and American partners are defending all along. Now, you're the first woman to be elected as president of Georgia. Uh, do you think uh, you'll bring anything different to your jobs uh, compared to your male counterparts? Yes, I do. Uh, I think that it's very important to be one uh, of the 10 uh, women president in the world, and that will bring some prominence uh, to Georgia in the world. But it's also very important in the task that I have within Georgia, uh, with it, uh, which is reconciliation inside, because the uh, elections and also the period before uh, has been marked by uh, very uh, violent oppositions, political oppositions, and we need to enter a reconciliation period. And for that, uh, women maybe are better equipped than, uh, than men, and I intend uh, to be such a president that will try to bring, to be above the political parties, that will not descend into the political battles, uh, and that will try to give uh, to the society this more European turn that people are expecting. They want more peace and they want more progress.